once upon a time, in a cozy nook of the big meadow, there lived a mouse named Mika. Mika was not just any mouse. He had a dream. Inspired by the snacks he found at the nearby picnic spots, Mika wanted to make a house out of crackers. It seemed like the perfect idea. After collecting for days, Mika managed to gather enough crackers to start his construction. With some cheese as glue and pretzel sticks as support beams, soon he had built the most delectable looking house in all of Big Meadow. Word quickly spread about Mika's cracker house. One by one, his friends came to visit, each one marvelling at the delicious architecture. Mika, began Sally the squirrel, might I just have an, a nibble of your roof? It smells so delightful. Then Benny the bunny hopped over. This porch looks exquisite, he complimented. M may I, I just have, have a nibble? It was the same with every visitor. Just a nibble here, a tiny bite there, until, before Mika realised it, his cracker house had many holes and was beginning to look more like a Swiss cheese mansion. One windy evening, as Mika was settling down, a gust blew and the weakened cracker walls tumbled down. Mika found himself sitting amidst crumbs and cracker debris. His friends, realising what their nibbles had caused, felt guilty. Oh, Mika, lamented Sally, was so sorry. But Mika just chuckled. <laughs> it's okay, he said. I should have known a cracker house would be too tempting. Wanting to make it right, all the animals of Big Meadow came together with twigs, leaves and mud. They built Mika a sturdy and comfortable home. It might not have been edible, but it was filled with love, warmth and a lot of helping hands. And so, dear listener, the moral of this story is that while it's fun to create something unique, the true essence of a home is the love and community that surrounds it. Good night, little dreamer. May your dreams be filled with delightful nibbles and warm homes. Always remember, a house becomes a home when filled with love and care.